Please rise for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge of allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Today is Tuesday, November 22nd, Cycle Day. Good morning. I'm Eric. And I'm Allie. The Winburn Boys and Girls Soccer Team's Championship Peril order form will be available in the high school office until Friday, December 2nd. Please have your money available when placing your order. Congratulations to the following volleyball players for being selected to the Somerset County team. Taylor McKee was named to the second team. Hope Bittleman and Madison Leonardis were named honorable mention. Also congratulations to, Chris, to Krista Walker for being selected as the Wimber Volleyball's team West Pack All-Star and good luck to Taylor McKee in the, in the Cambria County All-Star Volleyball game. The game is being held on Wednesday night, November 23rd at 7 p.m. at Westmont High School. Attention high school student council members, your butter braid orders will be available for pickup right after school in A107, Mr. Slatkoff's room. If you have any questions, please see Mr. Podger Barrick. Today for lunch, we are having Papa John's pizza, tossed salad, lima beans, fresh fruit, peachy applesauce, and a no milk cookie. Thanks, Thanks and, and have, have a great, great vacation. vacation. Thanksgiving is a holiday that many Americans celebrate. However, many Americans do not know the history of this celebration. Most people think that the celebration was nothing more than a feast between the pilgrims and Indians. While this is true, there are many facts about the feast that are unknown. Did you know the original celebration lasted for three days and did not include turkey or pie? Thanksgiving was not an established holiday until Abe Lincoln proclaimed it a holiday in 1863. At that time, it was celebrated... Oh. At that time, it was celebrated as the last Thursday in November. However, FDR decided to move it up a week to promote retail sales during the Great Depression. His plan failed. He decided to officially celebrate the holiday the fourth Thursday in November. While the religious significance of the holiday has been lost, people continue to celebrate this event with their own special family. Should I say thanks and have a great day? Good morning. I'm Bailey with your daily weather forecast. Today is going to be cloudy with a high of 34 and a low of 26. Over Thanksgiving break, the weather will range from rainy and snowy to partly cloudy. The temperatures will begin in the high 30s and 40s. Thanks for watching and have a great Thanksgiving. Today's word of the day is spectre. A specter means a ghostly apparition, a ghost itself, or simply an idea that people find frightening. You can give yourself nightmares if you listen to too many stories about ghostly specters appearing in dark windows. Thanks and have a great day! Do vivid electronic soundscapes, dreamy, hazy vocals, and nostalgic, warm instrumentation seem like something to suck your alley? Well then Chill Wave might become your new favorite musical genre. Hi everyone, this is Jake Dreisel with your music genre of the week. So you're probably thinking to yourself, what the heck is Chill Wave? Well, Chill Wave is a style of electronic music that mostly began in the summer of 2009. The genre originated primarily by a number of solo artists who were influenced by the fuzzy hissing sounds of Tate music, as well as synth pop and dance music from the 1980s. The biggest inspiration of Chill Wave is noted to be Panda Bear's 2007 album Person Pitch which emphasized the use of vintage synthesizers and computer programming. After the album's release, some musical acts began to utilize their own effects processing software, keyboards, and computers for their music, and afterwards, their songs would be directly uploaded online for many internet surfers to hear and appreciate. Chill Wave attempts to loosely emulate the sounds of electropop, and also tries to achieve feelings of memory and nostalgia with the listener. 
Because of this, artists typically rely on low-quality recording techniques, giving the music a retro feeling. They also tend to use an extensive amount of reverb to give it a warm, happy, and dreamy sound. Vocals often center on traditional pop melodies, but they are heavily filtered. Although it was seen more as an internet phenomenon than an actual genre of music, Chillwave has had some peaks of commercial success and acclaim. Some well-known Chillwave bands include Neon Indian, Washed Out, and Tora Yamor. So if you need some new music to add in your library, then maybe you should check out some Chillwave. Thank you, and have a happy Thanksgiving.